something about the way that you understand. If you like tech and stuff, then do check out our new channel, Technomera. Link on the screen and description box below. Before starting the tutorial, you need to download the Spanther file. Link to download is in the description box below. Okay, import the Panther file into your Filmora. If you play it, then you can see the Panther running. Okay, now put the Panther file into the timeline. And now go to the Titles tab into the Titles section and choose this default title and put it above the video on the timeline and the end point of the video. Now go to the middle of the video and use your arrow keys to go either forward or backward till you see this black line like this here. Now drag the title to that point and now trim the end portion to the length of the video. Now double click on the title and then go to its advanced settings and then here delete this text. Now create a new text and write your own initials and then change the font if you want to and now adjust it to the left side. Now create another text to write another initial then adjust it to the right side. For me it's my channel name Technomania. Now your text will look something like this. Now click on the left side text and then go to the animation section. Scroll down and apply this right DIR insert into it. And as for the right side text, apply this left DIR insert. Now remove the end transition from both the text. And now at the start point of the text, go about 2 or 3 frames forward and then decrease the duration of both the text at that point. And then click OK. Let's play to check. Hmm, I think it needs light adjustment. Well, let's decrease the duration by one more frame. Hmm, still more. Why not we move it forward by one frame? Well now it looks good. The idea behind this is that when the impact happens, the title should come at a faster rate from both the sides. Ok now once the text is done, go to the effects tab and here in the search box write GLOW glow and then take this glow filter and put it above and now adjust the duration to the whole length. Well you can adjust the intensity of the glow filter as per your liking. Ok now the final step. Go to the sample colors and choose any gradient and put it above all the clips. Now double click on it and then go to its compositing and change it to multiply. Now you can see that our video now has colors. Well now we can adjust the brightness on the gradient to make it pop out more. Or we can adjust the brightness and contrast on the main video to make it pop out more. And now if we play it then you will notice. That around this position there is this swoosh sound. So let's trim the gradient to that portion and now if we play it then it transitions from being green to white. Well why not we add a dissolve transition here. Hmm, It looks amazing. So basically guys you can play around and tweak your intro as per your liking like adding new color gradients and stuff. And now our intro is done. So guys what are your thoughts on this video? Let me know in the comment section below. And if you think that this video is worthwhile then hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that I can able to bring amazing videos just like this for you. Till then see you later.